D O. If you can, you can't even see that. Um, don't ask me why it took me fifty minutes to eat apples. I got distracted on watching my show, but it's okay. Gotta be in uni before ten or at least by ten. So. This is my 7 a.m. morning routine. There doesn't, there's like not much that happens in my 7 a.m. morning routine because sometimes I'm like lazy as shit and I don't really do much. Sometimes I'll be bothered. So with breakfast, I always eat something small because I'm not much of a breakfast girly this early in the morning. Got uni from 9 to 7 today. Love that. And yes, now I'm going to get dressed because I've already got my outfit. I planned it last night and then I'm gonna do my makeup and my hair since it's that time of the week when your hair is on like the brink of its last days I put them in braids last night and putting them in braids helps my natural hair I guess this isn't exactly how my natural hair is though it's more random rather than this neat my hair's a little greasy at the top of Use some dry shampoo. And it smells like coconut. It's a really good smelling. Dry shampoo. So for my makeup, I usually do the same thing. So it's um, concealer, blush, and highlight as well as mascara. And that's what I do. And I'm bothered to put makeup on. So currently I am putting the e.l.f. Power Grip Primer under my eyes. So now I'm using is the Rare Beauty Blush in Happy. This is literally one of my favourite blushes. Because this thing, literally a little, goes a long way. And I'm pretty sure everybody should know this by now. But the product lasts forever. It's 100% worth it because literally a little goes a long way and those will last you quite a while because you don't even need a much of the product anyway. I'm saying that while I've literally got the brightest pink cheeks right now. This is just under blushing so ignore it. This is going to be what's basically under my concealer. For my concealer, I'm using the Huda Beauty. This is discontinued. I found this in a TK Maxx. Like, this product is so good. I really want Huda Beauty to bring these back. Because this is... She's really good. Like, it's supposed to be a full coverage concealer. And she really is a full coverage concealer. I'm not even lying, but this works better than my other Huda Beauty one that I have. I like low-key preferred this one over this one. You see that? You see? Also, if you're wondering why it looks so yellow, it's literally the lighting. Please ignore. I do know my shade. Don't worry. It's just the lighting's not really doing me justice right now. But even still, you can literally see how good of a coverage concealer this is. Like, sorry. I also bring a bit around to my nose because my nose is like exceptionally red place and i bring a little bit over my cheeks so after that i set with powder loose powder first the one that i use is actually my sister's but i poured some of it into a little container so it's the revolution one this for me works really great like if you want to spend money on a powder but you don't want to buy, you know, the Huda Beauty that everyone has. Because, like, I love the Huda Beauty, right? But some people just, you know, don't want to spend the money on it. So, literally, the banana powder is, like, a good, like, alternative if you don't want to spend the money since Revolution is quite, you know, cheap anyway. I just let this sit in a little bit and then I'm just going to brush it off. Before I go in with my Maybelline Fit Me, I'm going to go over the blush with my Dior Rosy Glow in 001. And now it's time to use the Maybelline Fit Me to set onto my eyes to like get rid of those creases because ain't nobody want those. Now for highlighter, I'm going to use the Fenty Beauty one. She's just a great highlighter. She's my most complimented one as well. I've added my 
beauty spots on just darken them the one on my cheek is fake just to clarify and the other ones are real i just darken them a bit and finally for my makeup it's literally just mascara i'm just going to use my eyelash curler and my essence lash princess to do my lashes this is literally my favorite mascara because this is the only thing that lifts up my damn lashes you see that my lashes have been lifted i also do want to get a lash lift i heard those really bring out your lashes but i don't know if a lash lift would be right for me if my lashes like aren't long enough and i just look stupid but Having a lash lift will probably save me more time in the morning. This is the makeup all finished and it's literally my favourite easy makeup look to do anytime I'm leaving the house if I'm not bothered to do anything more than this. This is what I do and it only takes like 20 minutes if I'm like really focused and not distracted. But other than that, this is the makeup that I do when I go to uni.